Welcome to 100 Nights of Taps, Gettysburg 2020. My name is Wendy Allen, and I'm the Vice President of the Lincoln Fellowship of Pennsylvania. The 100 Nights of Taps, Gettysburg 2020 is sponsored by the Lincoln Fellowship of Pennsylvania in partnership with Taps for Veterans and the Gettysburg National Military Park. I would like to introduce the President of the Lincoln Fellowship of Pennsylvania, the Reverend Stephen Herr. Good evening, my name is Steve Herr and I serve as President of the Lincoln Fellowship of Pennsylvania. And on behalf of the Lincoln Fellowship, thank you for tuning in to 100 Nights of Taps, Gettysburg 2020. The Lincoln Fellowship was founded in 1938 as an organization to remember Abraham Lincoln, honor his memory, and also his Gettysburg Address. I'm standing here next to the return visit statue placed on Lincoln Square here in Gettysburg in 1991 by the Fellowship. And on behalf of the fellowship, we look forward to the time when you can return uh, to Gettysburg to visit the Gettysburg National Cemetery and take in one of our 100 Nights of Taps programs in person. We hope that you will join us virtually until then, and also visit our webpage at www.lincolnfellowship.org to learn more about the fellowship, its dedication day program, and 100 Nights of Taps. Thank you. And now I'd like to introduce board member and fellowship archivist, Ken Keim. The Lincoln Fellowship of Pennsylvania wishes to extend to our active duty military personnel, men and women, and to all veterans of our armed forces, a sincere thank you for your service. I am honored to welcome Jim Steele from Jacksonville, Florida, tonight's Bugler. Jim serves as bugler for the American Legion Lakeshore Post 137 Honor Guard, Sons of the American Legion Detachment of Florida Squadron 137, and bugles across America. He serves as commander of Saul Squadron 137, treasurer and past director of the American Legion Riders Florida Chapter 137, and scoutmaster of Troop 522 of North Florida Council Boy Scouts of America. Jim started bugling when his father passed down a family heirloom, an E-flat British cavalry trumpet, in 1969. Jim took up the trumpet as a military brat living in Morocco in 1970, continuing with it and the baritone horn through high school in Naples, Italy, and Williamsport, Pennsylvania. While in college, Jim played in the Allegheny College Wind Symphony under the direction and instruction of Lowell Helpler. Jim currently resides in Jacksonville, Florida, and is employed as education manager with the University of Florida Jacksonville Physicians. We meet here in the Gettysburg National Cemetery so that we shall never forget our brave American veterans. We remain steadfast in our dedication to the great unfinished work which those who fought here, as well as in many foreign lands, so nobly advanced and we honor that they gave the last full measure of devotion so that this nation under God shall have a new birth of freedom and the government of the people, by the people, and for the people shall not perish from the earth.